AMD's Ryzen 3000 chips are kind of killing it. We've already seen the Zen 2 based processors crush Intel in sales, and it seems like the red team has no plans of slowing down. According to a new roadmap, AMD plans to reveal the Zen 3 based Ryzen 4000 chips in 2020. But before we get to that, be sure to hit that subscribe button and ring the bell icon so you can stay updated with all the latest news about gaming and tech. The Zen 2 architecture was the first to bring AMD chips to 7 nanometer, and Zen 3 will evolve that with 7 nanometer plus, which allows for 20% more transistors over its predecessor. Moreover, the 7 nanometer plus node also delivers 10% better efficiency than the older 7 nanometer process. It may not sound much compared to the jump between the Ryzen 2000 and 3000 processors, but it is an incremental increase, something that we've seen time and time again with Intel processors. The roadmap also lays out the plans for Zen 4, which AMD apparently plans to finalize before 2022. Turning to the GPUs, AMD also released a roadmap with their plans for the Radeon graphics cards based on the RDNA architecture. Interestingly enough, the RDNA 2 architecture, based on the 7 nanometer plus process, is still in design while the Zen 3 design has been completed. This could very well mean that we get to see the next generation of Ryzen processors released before the Radeon graphics cards. If the processors are released during the first half of 2020, the GPUs could follow soon towards the end of 2020 or the beginning of 2021. This will surely make things a lot more fun, considering that AMD has confirmed that their GPUs will support hardware-level real-time ray tracing, putting them at par with NVIDIA's RTX lineup. Of course, factoring in that NVIDIA is working on their own lineup of 7 nanometer GPUs and the fact that they've had a monopoly in ray tracing in games for over a year now, it's obvious that the green team will be competing fiercely. But all that comes next year. For now, AMD plans to release a 7 nanometer chip every month for the rest of this year, starting with the Ryzen 3950X, the first mainstream processor with 16 cores and 32 threads. Speculations also suggest that we can expect the entry-level Navi 14 cards, meaning the RX 5600, either next month or during November, while the high-end Navi 12 cards, the ones who are supposed to compete with Nvidia's 2080 and 2080 Ti, towards the end of the year. And that's nothing to say of the Threadripper lineup. AMD seems to be pulling their sleeves up to take down the competition, and now all we can do is wait and see what Intel plans to do with their 10 nanometer chips and their dedicated lineup of GPUs, and what Nvidia does with their own plans. If you like this video, be sure to leave a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and we'll see you in the next one.